Whether you are servicing your machines or have a preventative maintenance schedule with your local Taylor team, you should always ensure a thorough maintenance check is being performed on your equipment. Before beginning any work on the lift, the wheels should be chalked, ensure the parking brake is engaged, and lock out the machine. Use the Taylor PM checklist found in the back of your machine's maintenance manual to go over the 500-hour maintenance interval that should be performed in conjunction with the 1,500-hour maintenance interval. Before beginning any work, you should refer to the safety section of your maintenance manual and the safety instructions in the section pertaining to the area of work. There are other intervals when more major inspections and maintenance items are to be addressed, like structural inspections. Compare your hour meter to the PM chart to determine which inspections are required. Start by cleaning the engine bay and checking the engine mounts and bolts. Torque specs can be located in your maintenance manual. Change out the air cleaner primary filter. The air cleaner safety filter should be changed out as conditions warrant. Change the hydraulic tank breather as conditions warrant. Clean the transmission breather. Check drive shaft bolts torque. Check drive axle mounting bolts. Check steer cylinder mounting bolts and axle mounting bolts. Inspect parking brake linings. All seat belt components should be inspected. Change hydraulic tank return filter and hydraulic pilot filter. This completes the 1500 hour preventative maintenance interval checks. To order a Taylor PM kit for your lift truck, contact your local Taylor representative. For more service and maintenance information, visit our website, www.suddenserviceinc.com.